everyone and welcome to Ochiba Wolf Collection. I'm Ochi, I'm a Sailor Moon fan and merchandise blogger that keeps everybody up to date on new Sailor Moon merchandise news through my social media pages. So I mainly use Facebook for my merchandise blogging, however I also blog about new merchandise through my Twitter account too and occasionally on my Instagram. So if you guys want to check out what I've got to share on those social media pages, feel free to. I've got the links down there in the description. Do you guys remember my Sailor Moon World video? It feels like such a long time ago and I guess really it is. It's been almost a year since I filmed that video. I've got the link to that video down there in the description if you guys want to check it out, especially if you want to learn more about Sailor Moon World merchandise. That video is jam-packed full of information about Sailor Moon World. Most of you guys know that Sailor Moon World is my favorite merchandise to collect. It's just so colorful as you can see on these calendars and vibrant and really different than the 90s merchandise. It's so magical. I want to show you guys every single image in these Sailor Moon World poster calendars today. We're going to flip through them all. There were three Sailor Moon World poster calendars made as you can see here on this table and here is the size difference compared to my hand right here and I'll have the exact measurements of these calendars on the screen right now for you guys so you can really get a good idea just the size alone of these calendars. They're quite large. We'll go ahead and start with the 2001 calendar. So I'll remove the other two for now. So here is the Sailor Moon World 2001 poster calendar. You're going to see right here, we have the Sailor Moon World logo at the top. And we also have a gold Toei animation sticker marking this an official product. I also want to mention down here, you're going to see the original retail cost of this poster calendar. They were 1600 yen each at the time. That equals about 16 US dollars. I'm going to just be flipping through each of these calendars. So please sit back and enjoy some of these rare images during the Sailor Moon World era.
So those were all of the images inside the three calendars over the three years that they made the Sailor Moon World ones. And I do want to point out that on the back of the calendars, it's just plain white. And this paper is kind of glossy, so it's really good quality, just like a poster would be. And they are wall calendars. They have this little metal piece that when you first install them, it comes flat down here, but you just bend it up just a little bit and then you can hang it on your wall. I've got a bit of trivia I want to share with you guys about the images inside these calendars. So a few years back, bootleg posters and wall scrolls were made with some of these calendar images. So if you ever come across a poster or a wall scroll of these images, they are bootleg and not official. If you're wanting to collect these poster calendars, they are kind of rare now, but not impossible to find. Sometimes you can find them still mint in package, which hold up, I happen to have one still mint in package to show you what they look like. They come rolled just like a poster. So here is what a mint in a package one looks like. So if you're searching Yahoo Japan auctions or I don't know, any place secondhand like eBay or Mercari, and you come across this type of rolled situation, they are the calendars, mint in package. And this one happens to be the 2003 calendar right here. So you can see it's got the same image on it. But yeah, sometimes you can get lucky and find them mint in package like this, brand new for you to hang up on your wall or people will sell their used ones, hopefully not written on. But like I said, they're not impossible to find. You just gotta type in Sailor Moon World Calendar and then whichever date that you're looking for. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that thumbs up button and possibly share with a friend who may be curious to see what's inside these calendars. Also, before you guys leave, which calendar was your favorite? Did you like the 2001 calendar here in the middle, the 2002 calendar over here, or the 2003 calendar here. Let me know down there in the comments which one was your favorite and let me know why too, because the artwork is different in each one. So I'm really curious which one you guys ended up liking the most. So that's it for today's video. Please consider subscribing if you're not already a subscriber. I would love to see more of you guys on my channel. So see you wonderful folks in the next video.